Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Ladies and gentlemen, first, thank to Triangle uh, <coughs> for inviting me to present, uh, make presentation about uh, .post top level domain uh, project. Also, I have great pleasure uh, to expose to you the results of uh, several uh, studies <coughs> done by different UPE entities and the outcomes of a uh, working group like uh, electronic service group, uh, advanced uh, service user group, uh, and the postal technology center of the UPU about the significance of the UPU.post uh, and certification initiative. To start my presentation, um, I will ask to us to imagine and dream world where you can receive your uh, I will take physical or uh, digital correspondence and operate your financial and uh, administrative transaction safely from anywhere to wherever you are at any given time. That would be able now be possible with the true postal domain combined to the public key infrastructure certification which provide an electronic secure platform similar of the physical postal infrastructure. Let's go. Since the historically people trust the post and believe in the security of postal services, in the past the people will give us their mail, parcel, money. Yes, because we are very important. So Post has long established provide of mail, logistic, postal money order, or guild transfer, and deliverance volume services. So the post, so the post have over many years won the trust and the confidence of their community. As now, when we are child, the postal market make the trust and uh, give the trust the postal mark. As shown in this figure which presented presented the player corresponding to the secure trans the secure transaction throughout the relationship between the sender and the receiver, payer and the deliver channel is in, in one side, and the other side, the post offices and the bank operator, also between the mail delivery and the payment service provider, in first side and in the second side, post offices and the bank. But now the postal services is dependent on how the postal will embrace the new paradigms of the new society, like social network, like social media, of which services are one. The world society is looking of the way for the way and the mean to simply and easily identify and secure electronic communication in the everyday electronic transaction. Therefore, the question is, what is the base of the future postal communication and transaction? So, we have to create new view postal evolution with new services, with new players, with new business model. If, let's see these figures, so the problem can be illustrated as shown in these figures to the transaction security problem concept. By searching the mean which could easily identify and secure electronic transaction between the two entity uh, or two legal person in the same way that was as we do in the real space. This can only happen if we make sure of their identity, their addresses and the dates of the event like, the like in the physical space. 
throw this party as guarantor in the top down as guarantor for each aspect identity address and date this is new internet based communication environment is inherently in school society is looking for ways and the means to simplify to identify easily and to secure electronic communication and financial transaction in the world of the internet oh, let's see that the top post is the sample announcer nonetheless hundreds of years of traditional address system and postal competence should be integrated with the new platform hundreds of years of traditional address system and postal competence can be integrated in this view dot post platform it will regain postal control in the regulation and administration of legally recognized address in the digital world the dot post general ad let's see consists to take dot post level domain as foundation to build trust and secure postal services platform in the internet and also to make the platform an infrastructure for providing universal postal services in the information society and finally extend to universal postal services in physical world in the virtual world and for question why dot post the ultimate objective is how should post provide universal services in the information society with low cost in order to respond to the communication function and the traditional postal services is losing so the first response is the challenge presented by the rapid development of information technology of to traditional postal services the second is the laws and the regulation on an electronic signature are being formulated and enacted and the legal validity of a document <coughs> has been recognized widely and the third is the influence of economic crisis and the requirements for developing low carbon economy the post highlight the postal sexual world law the world's post to remain and expand as society trust her for trade and communication for present and the future genera generation in the physical and the electronic world the concept is to transpose postal physical tradition into electronic world by offering the attributes of physical address within electronic addressing including the legal ramification the idea is to combine the top level domain dot post with public key infrastructure certification technology to bring postal trust to the internet for users devices network and websites in this way the upu members goal is to integrate postal industry into the new internet market and to differentiate the postal industry on the internet so the dot post with certification authority will be the differentiate from 180 million domain name of by internet <coughs> by its ability to announce to these four question for the customer and for network society and media social like why who where and when about any transaction like transaction physical transaction or electronic transaction or physical component to the tra uh, electronic transaction so dot post with the certification authority will bring new opportunity to create universal postal addresses i saw universal postal addresses it not be only physical or electronic as is universal that can be combined with one electronic address delighted with several physical addresses which offer of us six new global dimension for secure transaction it will be possible to link your different physical addresses 
with unique electronic addresses. That's giving you universal postal addresses in three dimensions for time, location, and security. According to three dimension of financial, electronic, and physical area application, each of us will be either via the secure universal postal address space to set and to update online the preferred physical address to receive, to receive particular correspondence or transaction at any given time or location. The, dot po the post will develop standard naming, shim, 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 and nomenclature for the domain-linked electronic identity for the internet address standard under dot post and will be the KPS of identity information. For example, today, you could request your ordinary mail to be sent to your home and your express mail to your offices. If tomorrow you are staying in the hotel in foreign country outboard, like now, for a period of time, then you could use dot post with your universal and global address to specify the new physical address location for delivery for all your correspondence during your stay, not correspondence, but also transaction. The universal postal address should be viewed as dynamic multi-channel sorting mechanism for the secure delivery of correspondence to specific address at any location and time, the same way as the code is used in the physical world. In the future, we hope that in the place of zip code, we will, we will make the, your universal and your global addresses. So the target, so the target is to electronize the traditional postal services by moving the traditional postal services to the internet. Also to establish new postal services in order to adapt the social development trends and meet public public requirements for new communication methods in information society. And finally, to integrate postal services with traditional postal services by providing the public with full range of universal postal services and other competitive services. In fact, the results of the adoption of the post and certification authority will solve the proposed problem that I have shown in the beginning of this presentation by the ability to identify all actor in the processing as shown in these figures, the person by the numerical identity, like a digital certificate, the address by the global universal electronic address and the dot post, the transaction time events by the electronic certification postal marker, and all application and server by, the tail, by, by their digital certificate and I dot post URL. As I had said in the beginning of this presentation, that we have to create new view model of postal evolution with new rule, new services, new players, and new business model for the future postal communication and transaction as shown in this figure. So dot post can be defined as truth international electronic platform regulated by the UPU members of the postal community to conduct e-services, e-commerce, and e-government by, by integrating the physical, financial, and electronic platform. And we can say that dot post is simply the e-form for the postal community. If we can say in the right tone. For example, if we compare the functionality of e-phone to the functionality of dot post. For the core value of e-phone, provide three products, three products, e-pod, phone, and the internet. Also, dot post will provide three services. Three products, uh, uh, e-services, e-commerce, and e-government. And about the platform integration for e-phone, we have three topics. Digital music, telecom, and the internet. Also, the post will have three topics physical, electronic, and financial.
about application complementarity, the e-phone have business, social, network, media, etc. Also, the post will have hybrid mail, advertising in mail, customer's declaration, e-shop, etc. As we can see, there are new players like Retrial, Insurance, Telecom, ATM, Post Phone, and the Internet, and etc. About uh, the use case and uh, the example <coughs> of application, the dot post market and the business opportunity illustrated in this figure show shows that the dot post is the answering of the gap between of the gap by providing the trust regulated the platform by the UPU member and the international electronic dot post identity for citizen business to access to the securely dot post domain platform e-business activity. If we can uh, uh, illustrate and expose this chain, so the dot post system architecture is composed by, as shown in this figure, by the foundation represented by dot post level domain uh, com combined and combined with certification authority via the public key infrastructure uh, key and also represented the, by the components represented by e-address, secure mail e-box, e-identity, and domain name location. The services will be represented by physical virtual address translation, the electronic postmark certification, address validation and payment gateway, and postal export lead. The business tip types represented, the business types will be represented by e-commerce, Customers declaration, e-government, registered mail, hybrid mail, e-archive, e-flight confidential, e-finance, communication, e-press, philately online, and e-banking, and domain name, and mobile banking. As we can see that with dot post we can develop our market, we can develop our notoriety of trust for all markets. As concrete example, Let's see here in conclusion this figure show how we how with dot post and certification platform we can ensure and secure the entire value chain in the postal hand by products provided by the UPU like IFS, APS and all teams provided by Postal Technology Center. First by identification of the person uh, in the chain on postal hand and the actor via the throat identity under the global dot post, excuse me. Okay. As I had said, first by the identification of the person in the chain of the postal hand and the actor via the digital identity under the and under the global dot post certification. Second to, seconds to prepare shipment via the global customs declaration and postal guide export and the global address validation. Third, by the payment via AFS, International Financial System, prepayment and payment. And fourth, by the full loop, the shipment via the global track and trace that's given by Postal Technology Center, IPS. For another case, okay. okay. In another case, I will uh, be faster. And uh, this uh, case the shows the shipment customers processing by using the dot post infrastructure and uh, combined by also the UPU uh, product like AFS and uh, APS. And uh, until now, they, they have still been negotiation with the Postal Technology Center with the customers in, in order to offer one global system to take in account all processes for processing the delivery and uh, delivery of merchandise for any transaction like e-commerce or, admi or administrative uh, transaction. <coughs> About the dot post project uh, progress, 
concerning the statue progress of the dot post project, the ECAN negotiation, uh, the contracts established, establishment, and the dot post domain management policy have been achieved. In all, in other hand, the established resources, the marketing plan, and the service development and setup and the operation activity are still in progress. For the next step, the dot post project consists to put forward proposal on the development and the revision of relevance standards and activity participate to this activity, like naming convention, electronic address, business application standard, S43 and S40 and S52, organize the development of relevant government services and business application in products of the UPU like PCM plan, uh, certification, e-authority, and e-address, test tool, and also to publicize the importance, the importance of urgency of developing postal S services among the postal staff and enhance public awareness of postal S services. And thank you very much. Thank you.